Now, road closures and car accidents also impacted travel in central Virginia. This comes uh, while crews were out clearing the roadways. And 10 News reporter Tim Harfman is working for you. He is live in Lynchburg. And uh, Tim, you spoke to Public Works about some cleanup. That's right, Lindsay. Crews have been out all day treating the roadways. Let's take a look at US 29. This is US 29, the south lane heading towards Danville. Uh, we were uh, out here earlier for 10 News at noon, and this road was full of slush. It is now clear. As for this pedestrian bridge we're on, it was a blanket of snow, but now, as you can see, it's a lot of snow and slush. No, but we can't say the same for the rest of Lynchburg. So city leaders ask you to stay inside. If you don't have to be outside, stay home. Crews are working in two. 12-hour shifts with both plows and spreaders on the road. Public Works Director Clay Simmons says they're focused on the main streets right now. Right now we're focused on primary and secondary streets. Um, once we get those under control and once we've stopped with accumulation, then we will move in to uh, look, look to move into residentials. Um, and again, that determination will be late, made later on today. He says they have about 30 pieces of equipment out on the roads, but they're facing some staffing issues. About five employees are out due to COVID-19, and they have another half dozen vacancies in the department. Now, back out here with you live on Wards Road, uh, Sim Simmons says they're also working with private contractors to get out to those residential streets. But again, if you don't have to be outside, please stay home. Live tonight in Lynchburg, Tim Harfman, 10 News, working for you.